hello my dear students in this video we are going to write a program to find the area of a square rectangle triangle using function overloading let us write the preprocessor directives hash include input output stream dot h hash include console input output dot h header file and then we will define a class with the name called function overloading function underscore overloading curly open brace and here i am going to write public colon int area int a here this particular function belongs to a square that is used to find area of a square curly open brace and here we are going to return a into a and put semicolon curly closing brace so next function definition is int area int length int width so here this particular function definition is used to find out area of a rectangle curly open brace here we are going to return length into width curly closing brace so next we are going to find out the area of a triangle so in order to find the area of a triangle we must know the formula to find the area of a triangle here half b into h that is half base into height that gives us the area of a triangle so same we are going to use here we will use the return type double the same function name area and we will write here double b base comma double h that is height so curly open brace here we are going to use this formula so 1 by 2 can be written as 0 0.5 into base into height and curly closing brace here this is used to find area of a triangle next after this we are going to put closing braces and put semicolon that indicates it's a termination point of a class definition now it's time to create an object of this class type in a main function we will write here wide main function curly open brace here we are going to write the name of the class function underscore overloading and here i'm going to declare an object called f f is of type function overloading next clr escr if you want to write you can write otherwise you can leave it next i'm going to print out c out in a double quotation mark i'll write area of a square is equal to with the help of this object i'm going to call each function by passing respective arguments so f dot area and here i'm going to pass only one argument because we want to find the area of a square for example here i'm going to pass five and stream insertion operator end l so that the cursor can come down to the next line and it prints the next area so see out stream insertion operator now uh, we are going to find out area of a rectangle is equal to so here you can observe f dot area again but the number of arguments are different here here only one argument was there and here there are two arguments both of these two are of integer type now we can pass any two arguments for example i'm going to pass 5 comma 10 again we'll write end l next statement c out area of a triangle is equal to again f dot area here we have got two arguments only but the return type of argument is double so that's the reason we have to write here two arguments for example 2.0 comma 3.0 and put semicolon 
here i'm going to write get ch function and then curly closing brace for this main function once we compile and run this program so what output we are going to get we'll see so once we compile so always execution starts from main function only so it is going to create the object with the help of this object we are going to call each function so whenever the compiler encounters with the first statement that is area of a square is equal to this has got a function call and passing the argument f dot area directly control jumps to the first function that is area of a square and it is going to return a into a what is the value of a here that is 5 5 into 5 is 25 so it is going to print area of a square is equal to 25 will be printed so just because of endl cursor will come down and it is going to execute the next statement it is going to print area of a rectangle is equal to f dot area 5 comma 10 so both of these two numbers are of type integer so that's the reason compiler directly selects the second function so it is going to return length into width that is 5 into 10 it will become 50 so just because of endl again cursor come down to the next line and it is going to execute the next statement that is area of a triangle is equal to so 2.0 comma 3.0 so automatically compiler selects the last function that is area of a triangle which is going to return 1 by 2 that is half b into h here b into h is 2 into 3 6 6 half is 3 so here it is going to print 3 now it's time to go for execution for that i will take you to my laptop screen i have already written this program in turbo c++ compiler to save your time let us compile this program by pressing alt f9 here you can see it is showing success that indicates there is no syntax error let us execute this program by pressing ctrl f9 here you can see area of square is equal to 25 area of rectangle is equal to 50 and area of triangle is equal to 3 i hope you understood if yes please write down as s in the comment box thank you